John 14, 6 is a great reminder of who he is. He says, I am the way. I am the truth. I am the life. No man comes unto the Father but by me. J. David Brannan tells of Bill Moore, a missionary in South Africa, who went to help his mission organization in Zambia buy property. The first obstacle they encountered was that the mission was not recognized by the government, so they could not buy the land. This was a set as registration could take months. The missionaries prayed and God sent them a representative who got them the necessary papers in only 15 minutes. The second problem they had was that they needed the land commissioner's permission to buy the property. Surprisingly, this took them only a few minutes to secure. These documents could have taken months to be processed, but God made a way. You may have heard Don Moen sing, God will make a way where there seemed to be no way. He works in ways we cannot see. He will make a way for me. And so true it is. You do not have to know how God is going to come through for you. You do not have to know when God will deliver you. Just know that God will. When next you think that there is no way out, remember that God will make a way. Father, we are so thankful that you are the way maker today and that we can all lift up our eyes to the hills from whence come at our help. We trust in you knowing that you will make the way. Amen. Here's my thought for today. The strength that brought him from the grave gives hope in life's dark hour. Have a good day, a great day, and a godly day.